Why, hello everyone. It's been a while. I've been enjoying my summer, but I didn't forget about your TOEIC needs. So today we're going to look at two more TOEIC questions. These are somewhat difficult, and I'm going to show you how to get the answer. All right, let's get started with the first question. Here it is. First, let's look at some key vocabulary. Do you notice it says, to informing the public? The public is a noun. For example, if I said politicians want to please the public, they want to please people in society. So you can use the public as a noun. However, usually public is an adjective. For example, the politician wants to improve public services, or medical professionals are worried about public health. For this question, because it says the public, we are talking about people in society. Let's get the answer. First, simplify the sentence into subject, verb, object. So, our subject here is Enviro Unite. Our verb is is and our object is nonprofit organization. Therefore, when we look at the choices after, we are looking at a reduced adjective clause. An adjective clause describes a noun or a whole clause. Let's look at an example. Enviro Unite is a nonprofit organization that is based in New York. So, that is based in New York is an adjective clause. Or, Enviro Unite is a nonprofit organization that is informing people about environmental challenges. So, we have adjective clauses. Now, when you have an adjective clause, you can often reduce it. When you reduce an adjective clause, you remove the adjective clause marker. The markers you can remove are which, that, and who. And often, the be verb is removed after. Let's go back to our first example. You can see the original is Enviro Unite is a nonprofit organization that is based in New York. So we have that is based. You can reduce this to Enviro Unite is a nonprofit organization based in New York. Notice that and is, and is is the be verb, have been removed. Let's look at the other example. Enviro Unite is a nonprofit organization that is informing people about environmental challenges. You can remove that is and just say it is a nonprofit organization informing people about environmental challenges. Okay, well, we know we need some form of verb. It might be a gerund. It might be a passive voice, so ed. Therefore, we can eliminate d because we need a verb here, ed probably or ing. Aspiration is a noun. The verb is aspire. You could say, Enviro Unite is a nonprofit organization that is inspiring to inform. You can reduce this and just say it is a nonprofit organization aspiring to inform. However, we must have a verb form. Aspiration is a noun. So we will eliminate it. Now that D is gone, we will eliminate A. Why? Well, let's look at the original sentence. If we used the adjective clause, it would be Enviro Unite is a nonprofit organization that was proposed to informing the public. This is strange. The main reason is when you use propose, you're going to use propose verb ing or noun. For example, he proposed changing the system. Or you're going to use to verb. He proposed to change the system. But you're not going to use to verb ing in this context. You're not going to say 
it was proposed to helping people. And so you're not going to say to informing. So remove it. Okay, let's look at the final two. This comes down to context, verb and preposition collocations as well. Let's look at B. Recognize has two meanings. First is to know something or someone because you have experienced it or seen it before. So you heard a, two, a song two months ago. Now you hear it again. You think, I know this song. So you can say, I recognize this song. The other meaning of regard is to publicly give someone respect. For example, Ms. Ko won an award for her leadership. The organization recognized Ms. Ko for her leadership or as a leader. You can see the form. Someone is recognized for verb ing or what they have done or someone is recognized as a type of person. Batman was recognized or is recognized for his heroic acts. Batman is recognized as a hero. We do not say Batman was recognized to his heroic acts. We don't say Batman was recognized to acting. We are not going to have recognized to verb ing. We would have recognized to informing here. That is incorrect. Therefore, the answer is C. Someone is dedicated to noun or verb ing. Someone truly focuses on or cares about that noun or verb ing. He is a great coworker. He is dedicated to helping his coworkers. He is dedicated to his coworkers. So, I am dedicated to helping you get a 900, not a 100, 900 on the TOEIC test. So we can see the original statement here is Enviro Unite is a non-profit organization that is dedicated to informing the public about key environmental issues. We've taken out that is and we've just let it dedicated to informing. Okay, next question, 121. Let's simplify. We're going to simplify this sentence. Now, prior to means before. So, residence means home. So, we can simplify and say before showing the home, the agent needs to make sure that the home is what? What would be logical here? Safe, clean, beautiful. We will be looking for a word similar to this. Unfortunately, grammar will not help you much here. But we can improve our chances by about 8% with grammar. Let's eliminate C. Presentation is a countable noun, so you need a or the before it. We don't have a or the, so we don't have that noun, so C is kicked out. Let's start evicting other answers. Next, eliminate D. Present can be an adjective, verb, or noun. Yes, holy crap! However, as an adjective, present means happening or existing now. So the context would be strange to pick D. We can say the student was present in class, which means not absent. But it's strange to say the house is present. So the house is here today, but it might not be here tomorrow, but it maybe wasn't here yesterday. It's strange. So now we have A and B. Earlier, we were saying that safe, clean, beautiful, etc. would be logical. What is the closest word to this? Well, it is presentable. Remember, verb plus ible becomes an adjective that means people can. I can wash my shirt. It is washable. Many people love Taylor Swift. She is lovable. I can display, show, present the house. It is presentable. Presentable means looking clean and attractive. You can present it with pride. You can show it to other people. Here's an example. Before we open the restaurant, the interior does not need to be amazing, but it needs to be at least presentable. 
So we can see for 121, the real estate agent wants to make sure or should make sure or needs to make sure that the house or the residence is presentable. It looks good. It's clean. Well, we finished two challenging TOEIC questions. We could use grammar for some. We could use vocab for others. Please subscribe, like, and share, and have a wonderful day. Bye.